Hey guys, Michael Douglas, Douglas Lawn Care. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Recently, I did a video, a review video on my Steel MS 170 chainsaw. Uh, I took it in my backyard, cut a bunch of trees up, gave you my full review on uh, the machine. And while I was giving you my review, I uh, explained in the video that my chainsaw blade was extremely dull. So we're going to actually go ahead and change that blade right now. Um, while I posted that video to YouTube, I was contacted by this company called HIPAA 360. This is going to be the first time trying out uh, the HIPAA 360 uh, blade. I'm not going to do a review video on the chain today. We'll do that in a later video, but I am interested in seeing how this uh, chain stacks up to the steel uh, brand of chain. So let's go ahead and put this chain on the chainsaw. So this is the box that I got in the mail. It's a HIPAA three pack, 16 inch. So that just means 16 inch bar. As we look on the front, 16 inch bar. It is made, I swear I saw somewhere on the side right here. It is made in China. Um, so if that is an issue for you guys, don't buy this. But if it's not an issue, um, hopefully we'll, we'll go ahead and test this out to see how this uh, holds up against the steel product because um, it is a whole lot cheaper than the steel chain. Um, so one of three chains in here. Set that off to the side. We'll open this guy up. And I am in my basement right now because it is really cold. So pardon the, hopefully you guys can see what's going on. Um, and we have a brand new chain. I can get in a little bit of oil residue on my hand right now. Um, that's probably a good thing. So we'll go ahead and show you how to put the new chain on. So what we're going to want to do is flip your chainsaw over. We're going to want to take off um, these two nuts right here. The tool that you are going to need to uh, get the job done is this steel tool right here. Um, if you do not have this tool right here, I will leave a link in the description below to my Amazon affiliate link. Uh, program. I get probably a couple pennies if you purchase this through uh, my link. So we're going to go ahead and unscrew these two uh, nuts right here. One off and the other one. And yes, I know guys, my... And yes, I do know guys, this is extremely dirty and I should have cleaned it last time. Uh, but you know what? It is what it is. So we're going to go ahead and take this off. And it just is going to come right off. You're going to take this off right here. And we're going to go ahead and get the new one. And figure out how to put it on uh, with recording at the same time. So this is knotted up a little bit, so we're gonna have to get this untangled, which might be more of a pain than I had anticipated. There we go. There we go. So now that we got this untangled, we're gonna go ahead and put this on the chain, or on the bar, I should say. All right. And give it a little, pull it a little tight. There we go. And we're going to go ahead and put this back on here. Of course, while I'm making the video, my stinking tripod just broke. So we're going to have to try and wing it with one hand here. Um, but now that we got the chainsaw bar taken off, we have the old chain right here. We're going to need to put the new chain on. Um, and if you can see this pin that's right here, this is adjusted with this screw nozzle right here. And this, when you turn this um, screw right here, it will uh, adjust the tightness of your blade. So we're gonna go ahead and put this on here and then go ahead and put it on here 
Um, and I'm gonna have to do that off camera because my stinking tripod broke. We've got the chain on, as you guys can see, I am holding it in place right now. That pinhole right there is lined up and I tighten the chain down to where I want it. Um, I'm gonna put, go ahead and put the uh, cover back on and you can adjust it for the covers back on with that screw hole right there. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and uh, throw the cover back on and see what it looks like. It's got the cover back on, pretty simple, just those two screws right there. And I ended up tightening it up with that uh, screw that's in the bottom right here. Pretty simple, easy to do, but if you don't know how to do it, um, you might be scratching your head a little bit um, trying to figure it out. So hopefully this video did help you guys out. Uh, very, very simple. Like I said, if you do not have this tool, you definitely need that tool, um, especially when you're using the chainsaw because you're going to want to adjust the tightness of the blade itself. Um, like I said, I've never ran this HIPAA blade. Um, I'm pretty excited to try it out and get you guys a review on the blade. Um, if you're interested in this blade, I will leave a link um, to their Amazon page. Um, I do have an affiliate program and I'll make maybe a penny or so off of this blade if you purchase it through my link. So not really here to make a whole lot of money. To be honest, I'm just trying to help somebody out there um, if you have questions on how to get this back together. And if I helped one person out, uh, that's all that really matters. And this video was successful. So I do want to give a huge shout out to HIPAA 360 uh, for reaching out to me and giving me this blade. Really appreciate you guys. And I'm really eager to put this uh, blade to the test. They have a whole bunch of things out there from steel parts to echo parts. They have carburetors. Uh, blades, string trimmer stuff. Um, anybody that's in lawn care, they have they have something out there um, that's going to be for you for uh, whatever brand of equipment that you're running. Um, so go check them out. I will leave a link in the description below to their website as well. Not making any money off of anything that you purchase from their website, but if you use my Amazon affiliate link, I will make a tiny, tiny bit off of uh, whatever you purchase through my Amazon affiliate link from uh, HIPAA 360. So thank you HIPAA 360, really appreciate it. Uh, can't wait to get this, uh, put this blade to the test. And thank you guys so much for watching. Really do hope this helped one person out there. God bless, take care. Michael Douglas, Douglas Lawn Care signing off. Like, subscribe, see you guys in the next one. Bye.